Welcome back to my channel, Home Sweet Classroom. Today is Sunday and today's video is going to be a pack with me. I'm gonna take you guys along through my day and packing for Tuesday's trip. Today is Sunday and we are pretty much up to be ready by Monday, tomorrow. So I'm just gonna be like cleaning up today. We had some guests yesterday, so I need to tidy up the kitchen and um, like just our house and I've already done some laundry. I just need to fold it. But right now, for now, um, I'm just kind of like waking up, getting downstairs, and just um, starting off my morning. Maxie is having his cereal before I make him some breakfast and fighting with Rocket to not eat his cereal. <laughs> um, I'm going to be making some coffee and just... Um, Go ahead and put the news on, I guess. Um, put some a little bit of noise on. And yeah, so that's how our morning is getting started. Hopefully my other half wakes up and comes downstairs and joins us. Um, and yeah, I it's already nine o'clock, so I don't think we're gonna be going to the park because it's kind of late in the morning already. Um, but I do like to take him to the park in Play and stuff and then we come back and relax a little but it kind of got late this morning and it's like really hot so I don't think we're gonna be going to the park this morning but that's okay maybe we'll go to the park this evening or go for a walk so I didn't get my workout in yesterday so probably going to be working out today sometime today um, I do need to pack so that's what today is going to be all about in organizing and strategically packing our bag because I am traveling by myself with the toddler so I need to pack strategically um, I'll be coming back with my other two kids uh, Jeffrey and Bella so they will be definitely really great helpers um, I'm gonna go ahead and make some coffee and get this day started take good morning good morning He doesn't want to say good morning. Oh, so you can grab it. Uh oh. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and make some coffee and get my morning started. What I like to do is plan it out and I'll put it in my app, um, Google Keep super super efficient i love how i can use google keep to keep all of my plans in and i'll just put it in here right now i just have plan and i have it under the topic travel things some things i know i will need in the morning are like the sippy cup i can't forget to take the sippy cup right now I am going to take advantage and pack up all my stuff I'm gonna lay out everything like on top of the bed and um, just kind of play it out for per day I guess and um, just sort it out so that I have like enough tops and shorts or I'm aiming toward mainly dresses just because it's more comfortable and a lot easier to pack <laughs> Um, and I'm just kind of kind of lay it out I take advantage that the baby is taking a nap right now and um, Pack up some things laid out so that when he wakes up I can attend to him um, back here. I've put away the laundry and um, That box I need to open it up. It's like a like a shelf kind of thing and I wanted to put it on this back wall um, just kind of wanted to Test it out. It's like a it's like a rack where you can put shelving and then you can put um like your clothes and stuff. So I wanted to test that out and see how it worked. Um, I've heard it's like a lot easier to put out your clothes and then like per week or per day and then just kind of lay it out. So I wanted to test that out. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start packing. 
Let me see how much I can get done in the meantime the baby is sleeping. Okay, so it looks like I have a couple outfits out already. Um, I have some shorts here from American Eagle um, and uh, just a red top from Express. Um, I have a couple outfits here that are just like more casual, a workout outfit and maybe an extra shirt here. And then I have an outfit here that I'm still thinking about. Um, some earrings and I thought this would be good because it gets really hot so um, trying to go casual on this part and let's see I have two shirts to go with these overall shorts um, I really really like these overall shorts I got them online and just absolutely love them so I have two shirt choices with that um, here is a maxi dress um, I got this here and I actually haven't even worn it yet, but I bought it for this purpose that I wanted to use it for our traveling. And I have these earrings with it, probably gonna wear some sandals with it. And then another dress, this one is a spaghetti strap. Um, and then here is my bathing suit with the cover up for the bathing suit. And I have some necklaces laid out there. Another outfit that I'm thinking about wearing um, with the necklace and there's some pants, jean pants. So um, here's another couple outfits that I was thinking about taking as well. Just two different tops and wearing it with these jeans right here. And then um, thinking about this outfit, I do wanna take this top just because it's very comfortable and I love that it's, a, it's very refreshing and cool. Um, but I don't know with what bottom so I was thinking about this um, little skirt I thought it would be pretty comfortable with some sandals and that is it so I have a couple outfits out about I think there's like nine to ten changes of clothes um, but I didn't want to pack too much it looks like a good amount I know that I'll be shopping with my mom so I don't want to take too much of course and um, I'll just be packing all this up. And now I need to get the baby's clothes. Right now it is not folded. I have it all right here. So I'm gonna start laying out his clothes and then putting it in the suitcase. So this is what I have so far. Hopefully it doesn't change. <laughs> um, I feel like I should have tried some things on, but um, I do wanna take a couple clothes to like lounge around in the evening to change into. Um, so that's what I feel like I'm taking a lot of, but I have some two choices. Um, I'm debating to take these just because they're high and um, I thought it would look good with this. Um, but that's pretty much it. The rest of the days will be my sandals and of course my tennis shoes for that. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'm planning to get some nude sandals. Apparently I don't have any um, that are like stylish and I'll probably wear them with this one. And well, actually with most of the outfits, especially that one and those. Um, so yeah, let me go ahead and get the baby's clothes ready and then I'll show you guys in just a minute what I pack for him and how I pack for him. I'm gonna go ahead and take a short break because we are gonna go to the pool and then we're gonna head back and finish packing up, put things in the luggage and pack it all up because tomorrow I actually need to check in my bag and then on Tuesday for Tuesday's flight. So definitely don't want to be all stressed out and then forget something. So I'm just going to go relax just a little bit, make sure I write things down in my Google Keep app, things that I like, come up and remember. So um, yeah, I will be back going to the pool just for a little bit. Hey guys, so I'm back from the pool and I am like mentally and physically so exhausted. Um, I might have just like overdone it by going to the pool, but that's okay. We had a lot of fun. Um, I'm back home and finished packing. I feel like I'm really unprepared, but I still have one more day. So I'm continuing to add things in, onto my list. I'm gonna be making a trip to the store tomorrow to get like the last minute things that I need. Um, I decided to go with one luggage and one carry-on. I'm hoping that everything's gonna fit. We'll see when I put everything in right now. And then um, I'm hoping to go tomorrow to get like a, a, a carry on with like a tote bag because I am going to be holding the diaper bag as well. Um, but 
then I want to have an extra luggage that's like completely empty because I'm going to be taking I'm going to be bringing back a bunch of stuff. Um, I'm hoping to purchase a Cricut, so um, I want to be able to bring back things that I could make creations for, like T-shirts and little craft stuff that I'm, gonna, I'm thinking about making with a good friend of mine, and I'm super excited. So I want to be able to bring back some things. Um, and I, having like a whole luggage free would be like perfect. Um, I'm also hoping to know where we're going next. And that means that I'm gonna have my classroom hoping to apply and get that going. So if I do get that going, then I definitely wanna buy some classroom things. So having a luggage completely empty will be so great. Um, I'm finished here packing. I've got the baby stuff ready. I've got my stuff ready and um, some last minute things, but I'll do that later. And so let me show you what I have here. Okay, so this is like the last of it. And having all of my things, I showed you guys um, my clothes already, but I've decided to take these shoes. And then I've decided to take, um, oops, sorry about the focus. I've decided to take my bag here. Um, I haven't put my things in it, but this is where I carry like all of my products, my makeup and, hair products and things like that. Um, and I'm hoping to put this in the carry-on because I have to check in my bags on Monday and we leave Tuesday. So I'm hoping to bring this along with me because I need my things. I have two extra bags here for other things that um, I like to separate. And then this is for my jewelry. It's a travel box for jewelry. So I'm gonna put my jewelry in here in just a minute. Um, I really, really like it, except that sometimes the necklaces get um, tangled and I don't like that but I do like the jewelry box some other things that I'm going to be taking this is all of the baby's things up here well I'm going to need to take the car seat cover and that's going to go separately because we check it in on um actually I think we could check it in on Monday so I can I think I can put this on there already taking some diapers I'm hoping that the diapers will fit in there um last time I did not take diapers and we were like running around like crazy going to the store really really late um and oh I decided to take these bags I still don't know whether I want to take this one or not but um I thought it would be really cute for if we go like out to somewhere where there's like a lot of walking then I could take this because I'm always feeling like I'm gonna lose my purse so I thought that was um, a choice that I could take and I love this bag. My mother-in-law gave me this bag and I absolutely love it. It's like perfect for summer and it goes really cute with a lot of the outfits that I'm already wearing and it's small enough for me to carry around and it also clips inside. I don't know if you can see that but it kind of clips inside and um, it's perfect for having some things for me and the baby. So this is my luggage and it's quite big I would say um so I'm hoping everything's gonna fit in there we will see right okay so let me get to the baby's things um I have decided to take him a couple pjs I have about one two three pjs and here's an outfit this one is just like a plain t-shirt love when he wears the plain shirts some um khaki shorts really plain most of this clothes is from target we recently went to the states and got um a couple outfits from target um got a couple sweatpants that my husband wanted him to wear when we're lounging around the house and then here's another outfit this one is also just like a t-shirt and then some jean shorts um have his little bucket hat this one this bucket has actually from florida when we last visit it's super cute. These buckets are so expensive whenever you go to like the beaches and stuff. So I'm like, we need to use this. <laughs> but it fits in really cute. I love that bucket hat. Here's another outfit. This is just a plain t-shirt too. Kind of a coral color. I love this color on him. And some jean shorts. And then I've got a pink, pink Floyd shirt. I absolutely love this shirt. It is so adorable. Um, he has a couple band shirts um, from Target. Super cute and with some uh, shorts. And then this shirt, this outfit is also from Target. It says Dad Rocks and then it has some like Baby Shark shorts to it. 
This is a romper. I absolutely love rompers on babies. They are just so adorable and they're so easy to put together. He's like really into dinosaurs right now. So that's, that's what he loves to wear. Um, have this romper. So if we go out and then we have another romper. This one's like a muscle shirt romper. I love this romper. And it looks like a shirt, but it's, or it looks like a two piece, but it's actually a one piece. Um, so he'll be wearing this. This one's from Baby Gap. We actually bought this at the Gently Used Clothing Store. And this one's from Target. This one says, stay cool. And it's also a romper. And a couple more outfits. Here's another romper he's wearing. Bringing his swimming shorts and swimming shirt. This one has a hoodie to it and it's long sleeve. I absolutely love this bathing suit because it is long sleeve. And then um, some more shirt, another shirt. Some shorts, Adidas shorts. We are Adidas lovers. And another outfit for him to like play and outside. So that's about it. I've got a couple shoes for him. Um, and currently his sandals do not fit him anymore. So, oh, here's another bucket hat we are taking. This one is actually from the San Diego Zoo. When we went um, last year, I think it was. Super cute. And a couple socks is also what we're taking. And that's pretty much it. Things that are like must-haves for moms when you're traveling with kids is maxi dresses, rompers, comfortable clothes um, is a must to have while you're traveling. I have found that it's a lot easier to pack and just slip that on rather than figuring out like a whole outfit or uh, the shoes to match with it, sandals that are have like the dazzle on it or nude ones are pre a pretty good um, go-to item because they match with everything. Just like this tote, it matches with everything and it's summer and it's stylish and so those are like the must-haves and um, I definitely recommend if you're traveling with kids <laughs> or if you're tra trying to travel even light, um, that's definitely something you should consider. <music> So here's my diaper bag. This is the Skip Hop. Um, this is from Bye Bye Baby is where I purchased it. I absolutely love this diaper bag because it ha it's like a backpack and it also hangs from the straps on the stroller. And um, this is the bag I'll be traveling with. And I'm just gonna quickly walk you guys through what is in the diaper bag. Um, I've already put some things out. This is a bunch of snacks. Um, this, these crackers are actually mine, but I put a bunch of snacks in here for the baby and I, and I'm using again a Ziploc bag to hold this all together. Just in case it spills, it's not, oops, it's not gonna make a mess inside the diaper bag. And then I also have a couple of other snacks for me, my um, yogurt, uh, a root beer, <laughs> some grapes, and put that in a baggie. Inside my diaper bag, I have the baby's cereal for this morning. He likes to eat keeks in the morning um, before he has his actual breakfast. And this container is from Carter's. I absolutely love it. It's just so cute. It just pops right open. Um, let's see if I can get it open. There we go. And it pops right open. It's super cute and it's spill proof, of course. This is perfect for the airplane as well. Okay, let's see what else I have here. I have a couple toys in here. Um, these are from Teach My Baby and it comes in a big container. And they're just, this one is a puzzle and it's just like a um, little activity for him to do. I'll be doing that with him. 
And then the other one is another activity and this is like a felt one. He can touch it and it comes with different ones in the book as well and some learning activity in the back of it. Absolutely love this activity play set. This was this is only two out of a couple of them and um, they're absolutely so cute. Some dinosaurs in here for him to play with. I have a couple changes of clothes and I also carrying a little jacket just in case he gets cold. Um, but I have two pairs of change of clothes, his jacket, a book, which is also felt for him to be entertained and just like um, something for him to do. Really cute book. I love this book. Um, it is, Are You My Mommy? And then I have, of course, the diapers and wipies. I have a bib in here, some extra socks. And that is it for in here. Um, on the outside pocket, I have the diaper rash cream. Um, I have hand sanitizer. And I have a, oh, here's another little snack that I'll probably put in here. Um, I have some cold medicine because it seems like we're always getting sick right when we get back to the States. I don't know if it's because we are an island and then we go from here to there I don't know so I have that and then um, some lotion a Vino baby lotion um, I thought I had some Tylenol in here oh I have teething uh, tablets because he is currently teething right now that's all i have in here um and i'll probably put his sippy cup in here and i'll be taking both sippy cups the water sippy cup and his milk sippy cup and that is it so i'm gonna go ahead and put those things in here i'm also carrying with me a um carry-on this carry-on is just some things that i wasn't able to pack i am actually taking a uh jacket because if it gets cold um i'm i can put my jacket on all right guys, so I think I'm all done. I think I finished and I'm ready to put them all, put it all together. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and vlogging with me in my summer days on a Sunday. Um, I hope you guys got some inspiration, inspiration from this video or some kind of ideas. Um, the point in this video was to pack with you guys and for you to join me in my journey here in Home Sweet Classroom. And today was all about packing for a vacation. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up for me. It lets me know that you like this video. And um, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notification bell down below and join me in my adventures. Don't forget to comment down below. I love hearing from you guys and interacting with you guys. If you have any kind of suggestions or ideas for me and traveling with the baby or traveling just in general with kids I would totally appreciate you guys' feedback I plan to be vlogging throughout uh, my vacation time and showing you guys what I'm seeing what I'm doing and all that good stuff so if you want to be part of it and want to watch and join me in my adventures go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below I hope to see you guys in the next video ciao for now Thank you.